how poor the pain of old Terrace is gone. <laughs> of the God Emperor. Who is this brazen fool and who left the door unlocked? Silence, filthy demon spawn! I, Theodore Karamazov, of the God Emperor's Holy Inquisition, has seen through your devious plan. I'm not sure you understand. We have come here to banish you back from whence you came, destroy all that you have corrupted, and reform the Imperium with the God Emperor as our very witness. <sighs> See what I was talking about when I said the Imperium is sunken together like a failed souffle. Prepare to be purged from this existence, you one-eyed abomination! Father, can you tell him what's going on here? I said silence! Order Carl Masso. My... My Emperor... You... You... You said my name. Yes. I have felt your presence ever since you arrived on Terra. Ever since I... arrived? Yes. You have come here faced with complete adversity, having searched through the entirety of Terra in your staunch diligence. You have been halted in your progress by the very leaders of the Imperium, but you have carried on. Even have you been confronted by my very own bodyguards, and told directly that I am the one who ordered the disbanding of your organization. Yet you have not given up on your conviction that everyone is plotting against you and that the very core of the Imperium has become corrupt. That, that is precisely right, my Emperor. Well, now that you have come so far, I believe it is due time to tell you that you have done a great job. What the fuck? T thank you, oh, holy God, Emperor, to be recognized by the very essence of humanity, to be hailed by the one true ruler of the galaxy. It is of no concern, Fyodor. I am actually quite humbled myself that you never gave up on your ludicrous ideas even though all sense went against you, and decided to break into my palace anyway. Really, my Emperor? You really think so? Yes, of course, my child. Truly, you are the greatest hero I have ever had the pleasure of being rescued by. 
<laughs> Thank you, my emperor. Not to brag or anything, <laughs> but I do think I'm pretty great. What the fuck, Fyodor? I told you the exact same thing yesterday, and then you just kicked me. <laughs> Be quiet, Dominique. <laughs> In fact, I would even go so far as to take the title from my old friend Malkandor, my one true friend and only person I have ever had nothing but complete and utter respect for, and give that title to you instead. You truly think I deserve such a thing, my Emperor? I mean, I've always thought so myself, or I stared at myself in the mirror, but do you really think so as well? Why yes, Jador. Your looks perfectly match your sharp wit and unmatched prowess in combat. <laughs> um, I'm very sorry to interrupt. But an uh, enemy is still present in the room. Yes, hello. Perhaps we should dispatch of him? I'm not sure what makes you think you are allowed to talk, little Xeno fetishist, but I suggest that you shut your fucking mouth, as I'm just about to crown the new emperor here. Ah, the new emperor! Why, yes, of course, my child. An Imperium must always have an active ruler, and it only makes sense if that leader has the title of Emperor. And since I am no longer an Emperor, but a god, it would only be fair to pass that title on to someone such as you, Jogger. Fyodor, <laughs> <laughs> did you take your meds this morning? Father, what in the world are you doing? You, Fyodor, will be in direct control of the entire Imperium, including all branches of the Inquisition, the entirety of the Ecclesiarchy, all of the Adeptus Terra, and every single Astartes in the galaxy. You will lead mankind to a new age, where all have faith in the one true God, and the rightful ruler of mankind being made, and you respectively. All heretics in the galaxy will die horrible deaths and mankind will reign supreme, no Xenos, mutants, or poor people allowed. It's just what I've always dreamed of! Yes, I am aware, Fyodor. I have seen all your dreams. You have? Yes. Would you like to know why? Why is that, my Emperor? Because you and I are the same. We are? Why yes, Herder. When fucking Horus mortally wounded us during the Horus heresy, when we were confined to the Golden Throne, our souls started to splinter and float away from one another. A piece of that soul found its way to your mother, impregnating her with you. You were destined to be the savior of mankind ever since your birth, as you were both my son and part of me at the same time. This is both why you are here, and why you are so perfect, Fyodor. It all makes sense now! Yes, Fyodor. You have been led here for the grandest purpose the universe shall ever take part in. You must defeat my traitorous son Magnus the Red, who has taken me hostage. Yes. Yes, I am ready. This is what I've trained for all my life. This is what I... No. My Emperor, this is what we have planned for millennia. The prophecy has come true. Mankind is finally saved. I am officially done with this. My children... Charge! <laughs> What was that all about? I haven't experienced such sublime shard and Freud since I burned the last church of Terra. Seriously though, good job with the massive warp rift thing, just as I expected. My lord, none of what you said was true, right? I am offended by the fact that you even assumed this. I still do not understand a thing. Why were they even here? Well a while ago I decreed the disbanding of the Inquisition and the Ecclesiarchy, because they were fucking stupid and completely went against what the secular Imperium I invented 10,000 years ago stood for. What, really? That is... um... well... I cannot say it sounds like the best idea you ever had. Don't worry, it totally is, because as a result of my masterful planning you just sent the worst parts of the Inquisition straight into the bowels of the warp. So, this was all part of your plan? You fucking bet, your lipstick looking brother fucker. So, hold up. You only brought me here so I could send the Inquisition into the warp? No, you were also here to take the blame for it. That's... what? Wait, wait! 
Hold on, Theodore! Don't you... Huh? My Emperor! Spare me your religious worship, Top Hat. You... You actually speak! I mean, I am very sorry, my Emperor. Please forgive me for intruding in this most holy place in which I am not worthy of being. I was just trying to stop that foolish Inquisitor from invading. Yes, and that is all very good indeed. You have passed my test. Your test? Certainly. I sent out my decree about disbanding the Inquisition and the Ecclesiarchy to root out the biggest probable sources of corruption within the Imperium. To see that you, the primary ruler of the Adeptus Ministorum, decided to keep yourself loyal instead of going batshit crazy and burning shitloads of houses in response to my decree is a sign that you and your organization might be salvageable. M my lord, I don't understand. Salvageable? Have we gone against your will? You better believe you fucking have. I specifically stated that I never wanted to be worshipped as a god 10,000 years ago. The book that you preach from is actually written by my son Lord Gar, who just happens to be what you people would call a giant fucking heretic. Oh. Oh. Oh my Emperor. Is this true? I'm sorry to tell you this but your entire life and your whole organization is based around lies and deceit. I... Uh, I'm so sorry. I have failed. Stop your sniveling, you fucking Pope Stickle. Huh? I told you that you have passed my test, and I therefore deem you worthy of reforming your organization to serve my true intentions. The time is nigh to fix the plumbing of this Imperium, as layers upon layers of sanctimonious shit has clogged it up for too many millennia. That is... I... I am most humbled, my Emperor. I will follow you no matter where you may lead us. See, if everyone said that we wouldn't have any problems ever. Take notes, Magnus. Yeah, one second you're all like, I don't want to be a god, and the next you're like, but you should all still treat me like one. Be quiet before I pour Prometheum juice into your eye. But, 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 but my lord, I have a question if I may. Yes, you may still wear your stupid fucking hat. That was my second question, actually. But my emperor, if I'm to reform the Adeptus Ministorum to work as you intended to, would that not spawn giant chasms of disbelief and rebellion within the entirety of mankind? We have been indoctrinated into believing the Lectitio Divinitatus for millennia! Easy solution. We will release a reprint of the book that is actually completely different. It should have a shiny cover, some pretty pictures, and the Emperor's seal of approval upon it. We'll release it all over the galaxy, and make sure every fucker in the Imperium reads it. And don't worry about them suspecting foul play, from my personal experience with the current day citizens of the Imperium, they could then tell an Aquila symbol from a fucking parrot. Oh. Oh. Very well, my lord. Thank you for setting my path straight. I have a lot of work to take care of, but I shall succeed in your name. Fantabulous. Go forth, Schlongtop. Oh, and while you are at it, send a message to the remaining Inquisitors out there that they can keep their jobs because they are total assholes. I shall do so, my lord. I will not fail! If you require any aid in writing the reprint, just come up here and I shall graciously help you out like the merciful not god that I am. Thanks a million times over, my lord. I shall take you up on that offer. Emperor bless... I, uh... I mean, um... Have a great day, my lord. Well, that was certainly something. I'm just surprised you didn't notice the giant crimson demon standing in the middle of the room. Well, I presume that's all fine and good, since he's not even supposed to recognize that I or any beings of chaos exist anymore. Just like the good old days. Hello, hello, hello now. I did tell you that I'm not going for the smokes and mirrors approach anymore. What are you even talking about? You just sent like 80% of the Inquisition into the warp by tricking their leader that he was you. Well, he never fucking asked if I was telling the truth or not. Actually, I think he did. Shut your fuck-ass mouth before I put you back into the box. <sighs> that will do your fucking son. Where am I? Apollo? Are you there? Uh, Chido? We are in the holy swell, where all logic and material laws have disappeared. They all have been replaced with confusion, darkness, demon semen. Uh, it's like we were inside a mail up a cover. Wait, 
We are in- If you're alright, yeah, I think we're in the warp. Make sure you clench your butthole so no heresy gets in. We are in the war. The realm of chaos? Heresy! Heresy everywhere! Do not worry, kiddo. If we just focus on our task at hand and ignore the inevitable horrors we'll face in this realm, we can surely survive for at least one day or two. Ah, my head is exploding! Well, that's just fantastic. All of our troops are dying. Hey, Dominic, are you dying? Are you kidding? I've never felt more alive. This is just like what I'm doing with the spook. No, this is but a minor setback. I shall come and reunite with the Emperor, my father and myself. No demonic realm shall stop me from fulfilling my fate. Greeterlings. What? Demon? No. That is a good-looking beard you have there, sir. I too have a beard. Have you seen my beard? It is full of tiny men. Please, kill them all! Oi, right, lads. Everything's gone quiet outside. I wonder what's going on right now. Bugger if I know, all of our scanning equipment's been broken. <laughs> Damn bombardments and... I don't know if I'm the only one that's noticed this, but we're all out of that's food, true. too! Yeah. That's mostly because you've eaten it all, you fat bastard. All right, all right, everyone settle down. If there was something out there, we would have probably grabbed its attention by now. Wait, here. Hang on a minute. What's that? Do you guys hear that? Yeah, I hear it. Yes, actually I hear that too. What the devil is that? Hello? Hello? Hey there! Is anyone in? Who is this? It's an Espatol! We're breaking into your base! Everyone say hello to our new friend! Shit, 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 shit! Aha! Is anyone here? So I guess I'll see you there. Love you too. 